well as the hairpin legs, you also have a few other choices. These are all black powder coated steel, so they're all nice and strong. These ones and these ones, the A shape and the X shape are much stronger. And as they're wider, they also provide a wider bench top. Now they also come in matching table legs as well. So you can make your own table and bench set. So before you make your bench, you need to decide which types of legs you're going to use. As I've said in a previous video, these are around 20 to 25 pounds a set for a set of four. And these ones are around 45 to 50 pounds for a set of two. They're, these are around the same sort of price. I bought these from eBay and I think these were from Amazon. So have a little look around on eBay and Amazon. I found, I found these are the cheapest place to buy these from. There are some better quality and some more expensive ones online at other companies' websites, but I had no issues with any of these as of yet, and they're really nice, really strong and sturdy to produce your own benches and tables. So I'm now gonna show you how to make your own bench. I'm going to choose the X legs because they're my favorite. So let's show you how to make your own X leg bench. So the only difference we have between the hairpin the only difference we have between the hairpin leg bench and the X leg bench is that these provide a longer depth on the bench. So instead of using one piece of wood, we're going to have to use two pieces of wood. So first of all, what we need to do is join these two pieces of wood together to make them into one piece of wood. So created these connecting pieces which all it is is a piece of three by two and it has two holes cut out pre-drilled and countersunk on both sides of the wood so by connecting these two to this wood and these two to this piece of wood they connect both pieces of wood together to make one bench top So, so we're using 70 mil screws to screw these two together. Both thicknesses are four and a half centimeters each. That equals nine centimeters altogether. So if you have the screws just a little bit shorter than the total thickness, then you won't have the end of the screws coming out on the top of the bench top. Now we have a nice bench top. We're now ready to start putting on the legs. I'm using 35 millimeter screws to screw these legs into the bench top. So now you're ready to screw it all in. All you have to do is simply screw in the screws through the holes provided and then your bench will be complete. And there you have it. An even bigger bench top than the hairpin legs. So you can see you've got double the depth here. I think this is 50 centimeters depth. Still long enough to hold, sit two people. I think this is a great size um, for a dining table. So these are already 45 centimeters tall, which is the perfect sort of height for a dining table sort of height, so you can fit your legs under and sit at the table at the right height. Of course, you can use the A-shaped uh, legs, but that's completely your choice. It depends on which you, which you can buy for the right price and which ones are available. You can very easily build your own matching dining table to this design all you need to do is cut a few more pieces of wood to a longer depth and have your supporting pieces are just a bit longer so they support three or four lengths of wood instead of course you can stain these supporting pieces of wood to match the color I haven't done in this occasion but it would it would be really nice if they're all matching then you won't see the white sticking out from underneath. But here's the basic design to build your own X leg bench anyway. Hope you enjoyed watching. Please join us in the next video. 
and please subscribe if you enjoyed the video.